He wanted to get some place where he, he could show his, what his ability is. So that's where uh, he was constantly looking for a piece of property where there's water and, and uh, uh, big enough to uh, do what he wanted. So that's where the, you know, you come across uh, the gardens. And so you looked throughout the Seattle area and how did you happen to settle here? Well, uh, I know on Sundays uh, we used to uh, go for a ride to North End and, and a lot of areas uh, where we thought there might be water and, and enough land to put a garden in. So uh, it seemed like every Sunday he said, you want to go for a ride? And we, we, we used to look for a place. And then at one time, while well, we happened to come here, and the uh, you know, place was you know, quite uh, uh, bushy and, and, and uh, a lot of trees and so forth. So we had a hard time walking through the area. But when we came back to the back area, we heard water. And then that really uh, perked his, you know, years up in the, he, he, uh, so uh, after we looked around, well, when he came out, he was sure he wanted that piece of, this piece of property, and uh, so that's where it started. That was 1927, you were about 10 years old? Uh, yeah, it was 19, yeah, about 1927. So, and you told us you came off of Renton Avenue. Yeah, it was right out here that uh, we uh, walked down, and it, it, it was swampy in here. You know, it was wet. But then, you know, as soon as we come closer to the creek, well, you know, we it was all uh, wooded. Uh, yeah, it was. Well, he he, he wanted it pretty bad. And what, what are your memories? Do you have memories of that day of walking into here? Yeah, well, I know my school savings went into it, so. <laughs> <laughs>
and maybe those were yeah. excuses to be able to do that. <laughs> Can you shed some light on that? Well, <clears throat> I, I uh, far as that goes, I think that uh, Garden was uh, sort of a uh, experimental place. You know, you try something and if it looks good, you know, it's sort of that type of thing. But uh, he he said that he, he, he couldn't relate to the, the clients what he wants to do. So he uh, have them come to the gardens and he'll point out a place and your place will look uh, like this uh, in certain areas and so forth. And uh, so it was a sort of a, a show, show place to the customer, you know, what he's going to do. So, uh, so, but uh, whenever he put trees and so forth, well, he, he takes it as a, a garden, and then if he needs it, well, real bad, well, he'll dig it out and put it someplace else. I mean, he'll sell it to the customer. You know, it's Were there always long-term thoughts about making it a garden uh, open to the public as it is now? Yes, I think so. I think he, he had a, a vision that... Uh, he wants to make something uh, really nice so that the public could, uh, so people could enjoy it. So, so he was really happy to show people around. Yeah.